Yeah, perfect. I think Matt's getting a job offer right now. Very excited about it. Awesome. Thank you too, Craig. So what was that, Squishy? Uh, that was just a job offer you know, <laughs> up in uh, Washington State. <laughs> Squishy, are we moving to Washington? Uh, it certainly looks that way. Thought I would talk that over with you and see how you felt about <laughs> it. Guys, we're moving to Washington! Woo! Why would we ever leave this? I know, it's so pretty. <laughs> Squishy, I'm so proud of you. Mm -hmm. Okay guys, so we're like actually starting to get things figured out now and I wanted to update you. Our plan is to move in 10 days. 10 days! Which is freaking nuts. <laughs> um, so we are gonna go try to find like a big dog crate to move Poppy in and get some boxes. We need to figure out our schedules so we can like see everybody, play for an apartment. Step one, step one. Ah, I need a glass of wine. Okay, Squishy, are you ready? Let's do it. <laughs> no, I have to put all this stuff. <laughs> We've got boxes on boxes already, guys. So, Matt and I applied for an apartment, what, like an hour ago? Like 10 minutes ago. Oh Let my gosh, it's so really late. Let's see, let's see, it's a really, really, really All mail. Your application, five minutes ago. Five minutes! We've been approved! Woo! Woo! So, we are going to move into a gorgeous apartment. Um, and yeah, we've got all these boxes. We have to figure out how to move Poppy Girl, but Poppy yeah. Girl go for a ride. <laughs> she does not. Do you want to go for them right in the car? <laughs> the first couple of boxes are packed. How are you feeling? Good. Hurt my back already? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> you old man. That's what I'm doing. I hurt my back on the first day, and then you have to do everything. Um, I vote we don't do that. Okay, guys. Night one, we have quite a few boxes packed. Poppy is not happy about it. She does not know what's happening. We are making our first trip of decluttering stuff to Goodwill. Matt Purge. <laughs> cute little Santa hat. We're getting rid of a lot of stuff. So we're in day three now of packing. And everything is a disaster. Hi, puppy girl. You don't know what's going on, huh? Puppy girl. Hi, baby. It's gonna be okay. We're gonna go on a long car ride. Hey guys, so I haven't updated you in a few days, but we are well underway with packing. It's currently Wednesday. We move on Saturday. So I just wanna show you, first of all, hi, puppy. This is a disaster area that's currently taking care of our insurance. We just figured out that, or we just found out that Poppy is approved as a service animal in our complex. So we get to have her with us, which obviously we wouldn't have signed the lease if we couldn't. Um, so that's really good news. Currently, what my house looks like. For reference, this is taller than me. So just boxes. And look at my little jungle, all ready to go. This guy's seen better days. And Annalise is here to hang out with us. Hello. Best friend time before we See, ch see each other very soon. Yeah, that's what I was gonna say, bye. Good morning, guys. So today is our unofficial first day of moving. Just woke up, we have to go get the truck. We had like the worst night of sleep ever last night because we got home late from Disneyland and then we've been keeping Poppy in like a big X pen um, since there's all kinds of like moving stuff going on um, and we don't want her to get hurt or like get into anything she shouldn't. Last night she figured out how to get out, so we were woken up twice by that. So it's like almost nine o'clock now. We were supposed to pick up our truck at eight, but what you gonna do? <laughs> All right, guys, we have a moving truck in our possession. It's really real. Who's that cute driver? Ow, ow! Guess what? What? It has cruise control. Oh, you lucky boy. It's a big boy. How are you feeling about driving it? Good. Yeah, yeah, I think I it's think gonna be okay. I need to adjust, I'm adjusting my mirrors right now. That is a huge mirror. <laughs> All right, let's start loading up. If you are wondering what my disaster of a house looks like, I'm gonna show you because I don't know how we're gonna get all of this done today. So this is what we built to keep our very naughty escape artist in. <gasps> You're not happy about it, huh, sweet girl? So clearly there's still stuff everywhere. Why didn't we do all this before today? First box is going in the truck. That's over there with like a whole stack and I have like one box. Okay, so we've got our first boxes in here. We have non-fragile, and we have fragile, and we have a flossing husband. <laughs> 
Hey guys, so update. It is Friday night now, so we're supposed to leave tomorrow morning, and we've been working all day. Um, it's past midnight now, and we're still not done, so we're gonna have to get up in the morning and try to do the rest of this, and I'm really frustrated and sad. I don't know. This move is, like, hard for me in the first place, just because, like, Southern California is my home. It's like the only place I've ever lived. It's where my family is. Um, it's just been a really hard day. So I'm going to try to get some sleep. And my feet are a wreck right now. So hopefully they'll feel a little bit better by the morning. And maybe I'll feel a little bit better. But right now I'm just not feeling great. <sighs> See you guys tomorrow. All right, it's actual moving day now. And we're still packing. <laughs> That's the truck. <laughs> We've got quite a bit of stuff left to get, but we're hoping to be on the road by noon because um, it's a 10 hour drive without traffic or stops. So if we are on the road any later than that, we're gonna get there at like 3 a.m. So <laughs> noon it is. That's the goal. So this is what we have left. Not too much. It's getting better. One room empty. Two rooms empty. And the bathroom is empty. I'm not sad to be leaving this bathroom. It's really ugly. Currently sitting in front of our very full moving truck, wondering if we're gonna get everything in here. We've still got bikes and a chair. It's gonna be so close. It's already like three o'clock and we haven't left yet. And it's like a 10 hour drive with no traffic and no stops. And that's just the first day. We also have to drive tomorrow. At this point, everything is all done but we're probably gonna need to just drive straight through the night, which is gonna be interesting. <laughs> Road trip. Bye number 35. Thank you for all the memories. We love living here. Kinski, one way. We're not coming back. That makes me so sad. I'm definitely emotional from the move and from everything being so crazy and I don't know, I just really love living here. So hopefully I'll love living the next place just as much. Okay, so update. I am in this car, which is absolutely packed, and we're at the truck rental place, and they are closed. So we missed it. So we don't have anything to put this car on because we've got a car carrier that we need to attach to the big van. So is on the phone with them trying to figure out where the nearest one is, and it looks like it's going to be in Lakewood, which is like 20 miles from here. And I can't really see anything out of my back right window. <sighs> this move is going to kill me. Uh... Hi guys, you can't really see me right now, but I wanted to give you an update anyways. So we got to the place and they were closed, and then our backup place didn't have a car carrier. So we had to drive to La Habra, but we got a car carrier, and we're on the road now, and it's taking us through this like back woods, crazy, twisty, windy road to get to the freeway, which doesn't make any sense. This is in Southern California, so why does this even exist? I think we went through the foothills. Really? Because now we're going downhill, and we were going uphill almost that entire huh. time. Well, regardless, we're on our way finally. Right now we're scheduled to get to our midway point at 4.30 in the morning. So, yeah, that's happening. Last in so I just drove the truck for like three hours and it's 3 a.m. So I'm gonna try to get some sleep before I have to drive again. It's cold. Mm -hmm. Okay guys, so update. We just crossed into the Oregon border and it's daylight. So we officially made it through the night, which is super cool. Um, we're expected in a little after three and the actual check-in time for our apartment is at four. So everything is looking good. Um, we are about two hours away from our apartment complex now. It is raining like crazy because, you know, Seattle is what happens here, apparently, I've heard. Um, so the next time that I see you guys, we'll probably be in our new apartment. Yay! Okay, guys, we're here. We got the keys. Let's go see what the apartment looks like. 